Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's JR. You're checking out the Sport Brief. We have the fastest man on the planet. Can I say universe? <laughs> yeah, you can say universe. Yeah. We're going to say universe. It's New York City. It's Gatorade. Beat the heat. Now, I have a few questions for you, and I want to know why Jamaican sprinters are the best. We're going to get to that. But but tell us about the whole Gatorade Beat the Heat campaign, man. Oh, it's, it's all about educating uh, the young kids, athletes, older people about um, staying hydrated. Uh, um, getting Gatorade because a lot of people feel like drinking water alone will help you to stay at journey. It won't because when you sweat, you sweat more than just water. Uh, so for me, you got to, that electrolyze helps you to hydrate your body, getting back in the heat. I'm from Jamaica, so it's, it's pretty hot down there uh, throughout the summer, even before the summer, it's always hot in Jamaica. So for me, I always try to stay hydrated, especially before, because you need to be hydrated before you actually start running, not only during training but before you got to go into training what I did so for me Gatorade has worked for me for years now it's continued this great product so listen man how early or, or prior to a race do you start the the hydration process or really start thinking about it from from home from you from if you at the hotel you got to start hydrating from then uh, you got to get your Gatorade in uh, from the start throughout the day and then when you start working you start you keep continue sipping throughout the program to keep keep your hydration up because especially me because I sweat a lot mm -hmm. so I have to keep drinking throughout and then after then you can slow it down and go through the day because my coach always said listen the key thing is to be hydrated you don't want to get cramps then you get injuries and stuff like that so this is why electrolytes are very good I hear you man uh, before we end uh, I think I'm gonna put some electrolytes in me because <laughs> listen we not in Jamaica right now this ain't Kingston uh, this is New York City and it's thick out here man yeah. the, the humidity is crazy but listen, man, everybody knows about your accolades. We could talk about the things that you have done forever. But when you talk about Jamaican sprinters, can you give me three reasons? Three reasons why Jamaica has the best sprinters, man. I, I think uh, always ex people always try to find different reasons. But I think the main reason is uh, we have a championship called Boys and Girls Championships. Uh, and I think that's where all the athletes come together. That's where all the talent comes out. Uh, take for instance, you, in, in the States you got ba baseball, you got basketball, that's where most of the talent is. In Brazil you have football and stuff. So in, in Jamaica it's all about track and field. So we produce a lot of athletes because all the athletes from all around the, uh, Jamaica come together and compete and they want to be the best. So that's where all we see all the talent coming out. One reason, me a second one bro. Uh, I think maybe the food. <laughs> I think maybe the food. Here we go. <laughs> uh, uh, because we eat a lot of uh, ground food like yam, potatoes and stuff like that so we get it originally from the ground um, and people people always say I don't know how true this is that uh, from slavery back in the day okay. so we come from African stuff so it's different so I should be fat I should be fast too right you should be <laughs> you oh no I'm fast and, and by the way people go ahead and click right there we got a second part I've hydrated and your main man Hussein is actually gonna show me and give me some tips on how I can speed up my game it's almost impossible all right I stink it's pretty bad but we'll see what I can do <laughs> the world's fastest man told me I stink now I'm faster than you uh, I'm faster than 95 percent of the people out there I'm gonna hydrate Gatorade is running this campaign all throughout the summer about people staying hydrated where can people follow and learn more about yourself which they probably already know a million things and also about the campaign here for me um, for me you just gotta follow um, I'll be all over this summer. I'll be doing the World Championships in, in Beijing. I'll be doing a lot of meets. Um, so you can definitely go on my website. You'll see different Gatorade things on my website also. So, and I'm sure if you follow the Gatorade websites also, you definitely see get to see all these things and I would stay agile and stay focused and stuff. And all those links are floating above my head. They're floating above his head, and they also happen to be in the description right now. Any world records that's going to be broken? I'm working on it. I'm, I'm working on these world records. I think that this season everything is going smoothly so far, so I think when I get to Beijing, it should be ready to go. It's time for me to break my own records. Gatorade, hydrated. Hussein, just say peace to everybody out there. Peace. I'm out. I'm fast. I'm fast. Don't listen. I'm fast. Don't listen.